This video is about map 34 and bidirectional mapping versus one-to-end multicast mapping of the AM3440. Here we see a map 34 screen over here if you'll notice. Just one map choice. That's typical. If you look at the terminal setup screen, S a for system. AM3440 is default one to one bidirectional. That's this type of mapping. Here, here, map. Goes both ways. It's bidirectional mapping. We'll unmap that. Activate our unmap. Look at our terminal screen. Change this to one to end multicast. Save that. Go back to our back to our mapping screen here. Under tools, refresh. This reads the AM thirty four forty. Now by directional mapping, one way and one way. One to end multicast. T one to an E and M, we can map here to here, both ways. Normal mapping. We may wish to have this incoming off the T1, this E1, monitored here. By doing that, we're now coming in and hearing it at this point. We may have a different situation where, on this E and M, card here, we want all of these to go to here. Well, one at a time we can do that. And to here. And to here. And to here. And to here. We're broadcasting that ENM channel. And why would we do that? We might have a simplex one-way broadcast, an RS-232 or an audio channel going out to multiple endpoints. Another application, we may have a T1 coming into an ENM card. We want it to come to a second ENM point so we can monitor it without unplugging any jacks. Third application is the ULSR PDH ring. This is a sonnet type ring done with T1 and E1 with the loop AM3440. Mapping, if this is a head end point, maybe an ENM coming in here, going off to the right and dropping out there. Another ENM may come through here and drop out at this bottom one and it has to complete the ring so it comes back in this other direction that requires one-way mapping, the one-to-end multicast. Let's go back and look at the screen here. We can unmap this sort of in MOS this way. And that gets unmapped. Now let's look at this one here. And we can unmap these. and activate all of that. At this point, if we wish to, we should be able to go back to our terminal screen if everything is cleared. Change this back to bidirectional. Yes. If anything had been mapped, it would prevent us from making that change.